All right, everyone. So today, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do just a very quick reaction to um, my predictions for round of 16, and then I'm gonna do my updated predictions for the actual ties because I got a few of these wrong, surprisingly. So yeah, we'll see what happens. All right. So we have Kika joining us here. She's just busy cleaning herself, so I guess we'll leave her to it. Um. Yeah. So I suppose I gotta share the screen. That, that's gonna be epic. Alrighty. So the match is, or the website is Daily Mail. So everyone knows. You can't really see it, but yeah. Anyway, so I predicted that it'd be Netherlands versus Wales in round of 16, Argentina versus France, Spain versus Croatia, Brazil versus Ghana, England versus Senegal, Denmark versus Poland, Belgium versus Germany, and Portugal versus Switzerland. Uh, okay, well, they were all wrong anyway um it's actually netherlands usa argentina australia it's japan croatia brazil south korea england senegal that's correct the only one so far denmark poland is actually france poland belgium germany is morocco spain and then Portugal and at the moment as it stands it's Switzerland but that game has not taken place yet it takes place in half an hour all the final games from group G I think it's group G yeah so I can't really say about this but you can see like what round predictions are going anyway time to predict these next games so what am I going with Netherlands versus USA I have got Netherlands in a draw. I have got bets on them. And USA have scared me. They're a bit better than what I thought. And Netherlands have been much worse than what I was hoping that they'd be. But I'm going to keep faith in the Dutch boys. And I'm going to say Netherlands are going to win this game 2 1 with Denzel Dumfries or whatever his name is scoring in the 83rd minute, getting the winner. Um, uh, I suppose I should pick the other two goal scorers as well. Um, Timothy Weah for the USA will put them 1-0 up. Then there'll be an equaliser from Klassen in about uh, the 40th minute. And then, as I said, it'll be Denzel Dumfries in the 83rd minute. The make Netherlands win 2-1. Love to see that. Argentina, Australia. Surprised Australia even got here. Um, Argentina made hard work of it, but they got there. So I think this one will be a, I think it's gonna be a 4-1 Argentina with i'd say rodrigo de paul getting a brace uh let's see who else far i think Di maria will finally score and martinez will will just cap it off and australia will get probably i don't know an own goal maybe uh, in their favor I'm kind of guessing here really i really am pan versus croatia i think pan are going to beat croatia or do i yeah, we're gonna go with a 2 1 win. It's gonna be very scrappy. And Japan are just gonna get their second goal uh, in the 60th minute, and they're just gonna sit back for the entire game, in which eventually Croatia manages to get one back in, say, the 75th minute, and then the last 15 minutes are just utter chaos. That's my guess. This next one is currently undecided, but it's most likely gonna be Brazil versus South Korea, so I'm just gonna assume that it is Brazil. Um, well, I think it's obvious. Brazil are going to trash South Korea to the point where it's going to be grim. I'm going to say 6-1 Brazil. Yeah, I, I'm not even going to go into goal scores on that. I'm just going to say it's going to be an absolute trashing. France-Poland. This is going to be grim. Because Poland don't know how to play football. And France have been fantastic. They've broken the World Cup curse. So I'm going to say it's going to be 4-0 France. With uh, Mbappe finally getting a hat trick in the World Cup, and say someone like Brand scoring from a corner. England Senegal. As much as I want Senegal to win, I just don't see it happening. I think it's going to be a three-one win for England. With say Rashford getting on the score, she Harry Kane scoring, and Slabhead Maguire getting in there. And I think Dia will score for Senegal at the, the end of the match when it's just pointless. That's my prediction. 
Of course, hopefully I'm wrong and Senegal win. But hey, look, I, I don't control these things, unfortunately. Morocco and Spain. And like Morocco, I want them to go through. Spain have started to show cracks. But I think they're going to go through. I think it'll be 2 1 Spain. Uh, this one could potentially go to extra time. In fact, yeah, I'm going to say it's going to go to extra time. It's going to be 1 1. And then, say, in the 104th minute, Aaron Torres is going to go and score the winner. And then that's going to break Moroccan and Hearts. Bam, there we go. Cool. Happy enough with that. Um, and Portugal against either Cameroon, Switzerland, or Serbia. Regardless of what team it is, I think Portugal are going to go through. Hence why I'm doing this prediction now and not wait until the games are over. I'm kind of more doing the guessing game. I think Portugal is going to beat any of those teams. And I think it will be 2-1. It's going to be one of the most scrappiest games you're ever going to watch because Portugal are a paper giant. They're not very good when they play together. Individual players are pretty good. When they play together, they're pretty shit. Uh, yeah, and um, bam, there we go. Predictions done. So, who do I think is going to go through? As a quick recap, if the Netherlands are going to get to the quarterfinals, where they play Argentina, I think Brazil are going to also reach the quarters against France. Sorry, no, I just skipped the team. It's Japan and Brazil. I think France are going to go up against England in the quarters. I think Spain are going to go up against Portugal in the quarters. And just to quickly go over this shit, uh, I'm going to say uh, Argentina will beat the Netherlands. And I think Brazil are going to beat Japan. And I think France are going to beat England. And Spain are going to beat Portugal. Then I think from there, it's Spain against France. I think, I think France are going to do it. I think France will get to the final again. And I think Argentina are going to just sneak past Brazil and find a way to actually win the thing. I'm still going with Argentina to win it. Although as much as I want Netherlands to win because I've got money on them, I don't think that's going to happen. So, here are my quick predictions. And I don't even have the full team list yet, but anyway, that's what we're going to do. So, tomorrow, let's hope my Dutch boys are going to go win this thing for us.